myself, let's check in. We are back with another video. <coughs> um, so, a quick update. I'm doing okay. I still need my dressing changed every day. So, I'm just getting ready to head out to the doctors to get my dressing changed. And I've got to go to opticians as well. Um, yeah, I'm still walking with a patch because it's walking without it, it, it hurts a lot. Um, so yeah, as you can see, I just hope everyone's having a good Friday. Um, I'm just in a lot of pain and yeah. So let's just get straight into the video, as you can see by the title. Spilling the tea on Terry. Towie. Um, it's basically, <coughs> I had a filming session on Wednesday and it was pretty good. But Towie, I'm not, they're unprofessional. They're rude, they're arrogant, and they just think that they're above everybody else. First shift was supposed to start at half one till half nine. They didn't start till uh, after four, I believe. I was on the second shift, which starts at half five till half eleven. I got there just after four. Um, they didn't start till after that after thought because apparently the tarry crew the tarry cast was late and um so they didn't start till then anyway and then half five we were supposed to start we did the second shift didn't start till quarter seven which is really unprofessional um we got there the second shift was like the party part where you go on the dance floor into the nightclub and you dance in and you're doing all that sort of stuff. Um, it was crazy. So the ambulance or whatever it is outside. Um, we, yeah, they're just really unprofessional and they're supposed to be like spread it out so that they can mix with everybody. It didn't happen that way. Towie thought because they were above everybody they would huddle together and just mix with each other and not anybody else. We, they had to stop it several times, um, like stop filming several times to tell them, look, you know how this is done. You've done this many times. You need to spread out so that you know, you're know you mixing with people. So when the camera goes round, the camera can see that you're mixing with everybody else. You're not just mixing with the cast because I was an extra. Not a class member. Um, we weren't allowed to take videos or take pictures there because obviously it's going out on TV and we're not allowed to post it on social media. Which is fine, but Towie, because they think they're above everybody else, they started using their phones, filming, texting. Um, some of them were vaping in there as well, so they had to just cut the scene and say, look, stop vaping, put your phones away. You know, um, we're gonna do this again. So they had to keep cutting it through every so often because they um, because they just they just wasn't listening. They weren't paying attention. We got through it. We had a break. Um, then the cast were doing their thing, and then we came back. And yeah, it was meant to finish at half eleven, but it, I left at twelve because, because there was another scene because they were late. Um, I was like, nah, I'm off. So I left at 12. I got home about after 2 this morning. Uh, not this morning, sorry, yesterday morning. Then I was back out again to the doctor's and then to get my dressing changed and stuff. Um, but yeah, tell me, you need to pull up yourself. And oh, by the way, everyone thinks reality TV is reality. It's not, it's all scripted. Trust me, I know, I was there. They read script from one of the camera screens and they have to be told what to say, where to stand. Uh, especially when you're dancing and stuff, you've got to be told where to where to stand, where to go, you know, things like that. So it's all scripted. You can't just do what you want, when you want. Like how they make out. I think the only one that's not scripted is Geordie Shaw. All the others, Made in Chelsea, um, Essex, uh, Love Island, and all those other ones, 
are um, all, all scripted. Just draw the shells. I've, 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 so I've been told, draw, draw the shells. The only one that isn't. It was just ridiculous. And one of the cast members um, paid a grand to get from Manchester to here in a taxi. I think it was taxi or Uber. She paid five hundred pounds from Manchester to London, and then five hundred pounds from London to back to Manchester. Now, I bounced, and um, one of the, the security guards told me that because you see that woman that I was yeah, uh, because I can't remember her name, but she's one of the cast members, and she's paid five hundred pound to get from here to Manchester. I was like, five hundred. So basically, she's paid a grand to travel just for that one day. Just to show, you know, people who have money think that they're beyond everybody else. Um, another cast member, I don't know her name, I know I've met Chloe, um, Jamie, is it Diggs? I don't watch, um, I don't watch reality stuff, but when I was there, I, the names were called. I can't remember her name, she's blonde hair. Um, her dress at the back kept opening up so they had to stop. She kept slapping James on the face, so they had to stop. They, she was like, they were all messing around, so they had to stop. And it all just got ridiculous. Oh, and then Pete was there, because Pete was standing next to Chloe. Um, yeah, and it was just, it was just ridiculous. Everyone was just like, what is actually going on here? What is meant to be, you know, you're supposed to be professional. You're supposed to sh be showing extras how it's done. And all you're doing is just like messing around. You know, um, not giving, um, uh, give, not giving an S because you think you're beyond everyone else and you think you're better than everyone else. Mm -hmm. You're really not. Um, so I'm gonna leave it there because I've got to go to the doctors and get my dressing changed. So this one will be out today. Um, but stay tuned for part two on spilling the tea on Tawi. Um, but I also just want to say to the producers of Tawi and the directors grow some backbone you you know your staff is not doing their jobs properly you know if they're late you send them home you drop that you, you cut their pay if you you know they're using their phones or vaping you, you can come out you know if it, if, it, if it was an extra that was doing that i'm sure an extra would be sent home but no because they're the they're, they're towy and they're better and beyond everybody else it's okay, it's not, it's unprofessional and you need to grow some backbone and be strict, you're in charge of what's, been, what's meant to be happening and it goes to show if this is what directors do and this is how producers are, I'm so glad I don't work in that industry because it's just, it's shambles, it really is. But anyway, part two is coming um, probably Tuesday, this one's coming out tonight. Um, I will film part two probably later on today or tomorrow. Um, but for now, I'm going to go because I've got to get ready for the doctors. So I will see you guys on the flip side.